working with Jim Dodson was very professional. Uh, if I had a problem, I would call the office. He would be there. He would call me. Judy would call me. Uh, it never put me on hold. And if he did put me on hold, with no more than 15 seconds, a minute the most. And she told me she was going to call me back. Within the hour, she would call me. It was, I was never frustrated with him. Every time I talked to Jim, he would sit down and listen and then tell me his opinion and what he was going to do. And I always felt like lawyers weren't like that. I always think I had to go to his office or send my wife to his office. But no, he came to the house and he sat there around at my table like he was family, that he was there, you know. It was great. It was a great experience. Very, I, I, mean, I felt like this is the man I could trust. The eyewitnesses say I was on the sidewalk, uh, I was going south when I was going north, and I said, you know, everything is wrong, what they're saying. But Jim realized that they were wrong because I got hit on my left side, and, they, and if I had to be going north to get hit on my left side. And the car was hit on the left side too, going into me. And he kept on saying that right out to, to, um, to the insurance company, this is how it happened. And then when I guess, when they realized it, that's how it happened. I was um, shocked that it, it um, ended so fast, that we won the case 100%. People told me, listening to people is the worst thing. They would tell me, oh, it's going to be years. I don't believe it that eight months later, it's all finished. I can go on with my life now.